Ready? Set. Go! Here we go, quick. Three, two, one. Good job. My name is Bunchy Young and I'm different. We have a training facility here in Norwalk, California, where we train some of the top kids. My name is Mike Evans. I'm the CEO and founder of Lace Facts. Force them arms up. Down. Eyes up. Quick, quick, touch. Here we go, push. I started training Bunchy about two years ago. He's a kid that when he comes in, he already is ready to work out. First, we did the warm-ups, of course which is Mike's thing, we all do warm-ups, we stretch, and then we got into it, trying to get tougher, tougher. A lot of the drills that we use here is high tempo. Knees up. In a game, you never take plays off. We teach the kids to take every play full speed. So every transitional movement drill that we do, we want to keep it high pace. When I was three years old, my dad, he took me out to this team, and they was older than me. So we went to the team, and they was like seven and eight year olds, and I beat them. I was only four or five, and I smoked them. And so they was like, oh, we have to have you on the team. Then I went to that team, and we just started progressing. His hand sticks out to me um, far beyond his speed. A lot of people see his speed and think that, oh, you know, he's just a guy that can run, but his catching is on a whole nother level. Then we got into strength with the weights and that stuff. Go! Let's go, turn it. Let's go, team. <laughs> Sit! Sit! And then it got harder, and as we progressed. Up! Let's go! Two, here we go. Up! Let's go! Then we started doing some agility drills. Here we go, quick. Here we go, quick. Now try your arms, try your arms. Knees up, arms. Arms. Don't pass me. Don't pass me, quick arms. Turn them hips, turn them hips, try. Who or what influenced you? Well, first God. What's on my arm is a Bible scripture, it's Proverbs 3, 5, and 6, because we always have to thank God and Mike, of course, because Mike is a big influence. I want you to stay low as you transition lateral. Because Mike, you always pushing me. Let's go, walk to the wall. Walk to the wall. Walk to the wall. Show nothing but strength. Nothing but strength. And Mike, you always drives me to never give up. Strength, bro. When you feel like you can't go no more, just always remember what you're doing it for. You want to go play at the top level? You got to push yourself. You can't control everything. All you can control is yourself. So when it hurts, bro, find the purpose. What's your purpose? You got me? Let's go. Then we started doing all like some more strength drills with the band. We had a, a drill with a rope. Our kids hated that, that drill. Quick, quick, touch. Here we go. Coming back. Quick, let's go. Quick. Quick, quick, touch. Here we go, push. Here we go, good job. My favorite part of the workout was probably the hardest, which we did the high knees. What's your least favorite part of the workout, though? The hardest. Like, it's like kind of my favorite and my not favorite, because of course it's kind of hard, but then uh, it's like, we don't want the kids to feel comfortable. We want them to push past all their limits. Everything we do is kind of mental as well. Because when you're in a game and you break for a 90 yard touchdown and they call it back, are you gonna still do the same thing the next play or you gonna come out the next play? Let's go. One more set. One more set, breathe. Breathe, let's go, breathe. Let's go, breathe. Come on, bro. Now let's go, breathe, in and out. In and out, let's go. Let's go, in and out, let's go. Walk it. His character stands out to me way beyond you know, any drill or any, you know, thing he can do on the football field. He's a great kid. Uh, a lot of kids gravitate towards him just because of his positive energy and his great, you know, work ethic. Let's go. And then get some push-ups. That was more strength. Ready, set, go. Hands in, quicker. Quicker, hands in and out. Down, eyes up, down, down. It ain't go count till we touch our chin. Give me 10 touching, one, two. And then after that, um, we just, we wrapped it up. Down. Five. Good job. In 10 years, I'm going to see myself um, being the youngest to ever go to the Olympics, being in the NFL, and starting my baseball career. Anything you want to say to the camera? Keep out first, keep working hard, don't give up, and keep pushing. You see what that son is doing? 
It's not just shining on Lottie with the bucket low, you know? It's shining on us. Check out the other videos right here and subscribe. Bucket low, you know?